Ladies and gentlemen, this is King of Kings World Series 2015, live on Fightbox. Fight number eight, blue corner, fighter from Holland, Isam Lazibi. So moving into fight number eight, the man wearing the legend t-shirt, the legend of Raymond Decker. Guy with 200 fights from Holland. Obviously, where he is from, this gentleman, Isam Lazibe. Trains at the Hammers Gym. Coach Nick Hammers, the son of Cor Hammers. Cor Hammers. It was like... It was like the father figure, the brother of the legend that's on the t-shirt, Ramon Deckers. And there's the man in the corner, Nick Hemmers. And also the gentleman there in the corner, Errol Zimmerman. So this match at 65 kilograms. This is a super fight, ladies and gentlemen. And this gentleman coming in now from Moldova, a local favourite, also a KOK winner. You can see here, making a spectacular entrance. Stanislav Renita. Comes in with an entourage behind him. man from Holland, not just fighting his opponent, but a crowd of about 8,000 plus here. <laughs> there goes the, uh, the little scrub, the rugby scrub of spirit. And he bows before he gets in the ring. So, ladies and gentlemen, this being our eighth fight of the evening, a super fight. So Branita Stanislav versus Isam Lazipa. So, the concluding fight for this evening, the eighth fight on your fight card, ladies and gentlemen. It has been victory for Red Corner all the way through. Now, will that remain in the Red Corner? The gentleman there, well known throughout King of Kings shows, a King of Kings champion himself, Stanislav Ranita in the Red Corner. From Thai Boxing Club, 
sorry, from the Lion Muay Thai gym, sorry to apologise, here in Kishno, the capital of Moldova. Ranitsa Stanislav stands in orthodox left stance, his opponent from Holland in the right guard. So poor stance from Holland, from Core Hammers gym. Nick Hammers, his son in the corner, along with Mr. Errol Zimmerman. In this super fight now, Moldova versus Holland. Both countries producing great fighters around the world as we know it. Scheduled the standard three three minute rounds of KOK K1 rules format. The taller, leaner. Isam Lazibe. Set the scales at the exact same weight as his opponent, 65 kilograms, the smaller stacked Stanislav Renita. Stanislav is 23. Isam is 20. Isam going way out of reach there with the high kick. Stanislav, oh, nice scissor knee though from Isam. Stanislav in with a two-punch combination. Nice knee from Isam. Isam in the blue gloves, blue corner. Standing at right stance, as I mentioned before. Southpaw. Going with the overhand right. Stanislav. Stanislav from, as I said, the Lion Muay Thai gym here in Kishno, the capital of Moldova. A lot of pressure on his shoulders in front of his hometown. Like I said, there's eight plus thousand every seat taken here in this fabulous Manage Arena. Pumps away and pummels away right above me here. Four fighters go for it. 30 seconds remaining. Change of referee, Andre Grosu. Like I said, has doubled up as team captain trainer for his team the Thai boxing club at Moldova referee man of all seasons and a really fabulous referee Julian Sulvan <laughs> well there we go three minutes down three minutes in two more rounds six minutes of action to go so, here we see some of that action. So what will the cornerman be telling them now, the coaches of Stanislav Renita? You've got Vladislav and Mr. O Mr. O Holobanu, Octavian, in the corner of Stanislav Renita, and in the corner of Isam Lazabi, we've got Errol Zimmerman and of course Cole Hemmer's son Nick Hemmers. And I do apologize, not sure the third guy is in the corner. Apologies. So one minute rest has gone. There are the two men who should be very proud of KOK as it's developed over the years. It's just gone bigger, better, faster. Mr. Donatos Simonatos and Mr. Dorin Damia, your promoters, the King of Kings, Eagle Series and FEA, Fighting Entertainment Association, and live right now for you fabulous people on Fightbox HD. Ten fights in 2016 coming up, starting it off in February 27th, 71 kilo, eight-man tournament in Riga. Oh, we have a cut on the left eye of Mr. Stanislav Ranita. And Andre Grosu looking closely at that. He's seen it too. So, first blood to the Dutchman, Isam Lazibi. 
Andre looking closely at that, making sure the blood doesn't go into the eye. That could be dangerous. And I don't know what that was from, I didn't see it. The referee is being very, very gracious, letting him continue for the moment. His cornerman will be very, very wary now of that because it was early on, it was in the first minute. And as of all the Dutch fighters, they certainly have come here to fight. But like I said, first blood is drawn to Isam Lassibe, which will boost his confidence, no end. Seeing so Claret on the Moldovan. So blood pours down the eye, the chest, and onto the shorts from the man in the red corner. So two minutes gone. One minute remaining. Anita's eye, left eye is cut, but the fight is still well in the man. And again, that jumping knee, the flying knee, it's a Muay Thai technique, it has been made famous by the actual flying Dutchman himself. Well, the cut hasn't stopped the fight in the man, and the man in the fight, Mr. Stanislav Ranita from Moldova. But Isam Alasibi has come here, the underdog, and he's putting on a great fight, and he's taking the fight as well to the local man, the local hero. And they go toe to toe, the last few seconds. Oh, big, two big shots at the end of, of that combination. And a, a touch of gloves, respect comes in. So it's time to go to work in the red corner now to staunch that cut. Here we see some nice action here. It'll be interesting to see how he got the cut. Was it from that? That two punch combination? It could have been. Possibly earlier. So the cornerman going to work on that cut. For now, it's not dangerous. There we go, 19th of March, Vilnius as well, advertised on the screen of the next two shows coming up. So the first being in Riga, 22nd of February. It happens every, well, 10 out of the 12 months next year, we have a KOK show. Looks like I'm gonna be busy doing my usual globe trotting around the universe. Globe trotting and around the universe, going to airports and Never always getting lost. Punch. Anyway, <laughs> here we go. 20 hours to get to Moldova from Bolton. Worth every minute and every second. Because when you get here, this is what it's all about. So, this, ladies and gentlemen, is the third round now. What's been an interesting fight. Very good matchmaking from your promoters. Not made easy for either fighter tonight. These two go at it toe to toe. They slug it out. Boom, big right, right above me here. Wow. And the crowd obviously cheering the man on in this last fight of the night. Both fighters are up for this, that's for sure. Woohoo! I love KOK, King of Kings in the square ring. Oh, man on a mission coming forward. Whoa. And I think just a yeah, water, look at the water in the corner, that needs sorting. That could have ended up uh, dangerously different. Well, the cut man, Renita St Stanislav here, is trying to forge forwards and put the pressure on. Now, if you know about K1 and KOK scoring, there are three main features. Effect, which is obvious. 
That means landing shots that work, that show effect. Forward attacking. That means keeping going forward over your opponent if they keep going backwards, that, that features. And also aggression, meaning putting stuff into the strikes that you do. Now you can still win a fight going backwards. Don't say that just winning going forward can win a fight. If a fighter's going backwards aggressively, if a fighter's going backwards and scoring, he can win. Or she. And this guy is at the moment scoring going backwards, but the man relentlessly going forward trying to impress the judges is this man here now. He goes into the last minute of the last round. The man who is cut smells and tastes his own blood and sparks him up. Pushes Isam Lassibe from Holland back. But he certainly isn't making light work of the Dutchman from Hammers Gym in Holland that always come to fight and he has come to fight tonight. This, ladies and gentlemen, has been is the ultimate fight of the night, meaning the last fight. Eight fights in and fight box HD here at King of Kings in Kishno. Manaj Arena, Moldova. But it's not all over yet in Moldova. There's still a bit of time left in this third round. They go at it again. <laughs> Till the bell rings, there's no fat lady that sings. So what do you think? I think it could be on the last round. For me, now the Dutchman, he's got his hands up, he thinks he's got it, he claps the crowd. They go to work in the corner again. Here we see some of that action. Nice right hand from ball fighters, followed with a left and a right from Stanislav Ranita. Jumping knee there to the face. Well, there's been some great action tonight, ladies and gentlemen, at King of Kings in the square ring here in Kishnau. My name is Sandy Holt. I've been your English commentator. I've been in the privileged ringside seat. Brought to you by the fabulous promoters, Mr. Donitas Seminatos and Mr. Dorian Damir. In association, King of Kings with FEA Fighting Entertainment Association and the Eagles Series. Here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds, my unanimous decision. Unanimous. Well, yeah. Blue Corner accepted that he was already clapping. He gets the win. I think it was on the last round for me. So Red Corner has been victorious all night tonight. Red has been the colour, the colour of blood, the colour of the sun, the colour of warmth. Red is the colour I use in Bolton Thai Boxing Club, given to me by Master Skin, as he told me what red meant. The blood of the veins that runs through us. Red like the sun, red like heat and warmth, the flames. Has defeated Water of Blue, the blue colour, and I'm getting all spiritual now. Well, there you go, up in lights, up in the glorious lights there, King of Kings. So, ladies and gentlemen, once again. Well done. So, just to summarize, what a good night, ladies and gentlemen, here in Moldova. King of Kings, fabulous in the square ring. It's been amazing here in Kishno, Moldova. So, ladies and gentlemen, and Fightbox HD. It's thanks from me, Sandy Holt. Good night. Good night, Moldova.